Hello and welcome to this football edition of Patriot League Roundup. I'm Gina Johnson. Three Patriot League teams picked up wins in the first week of football, including the number 11 Lehigh Mountain Hawks, who hosted Monmouth on Saturday. Michael Colvin, getting his first start under center for Lehigh, takes the shotgun snap and runs up the middle for the five-yard touchdown and the early 7-0 lead. Later in the first quarter, Colvin caps a 63-yard drive with this screen pass to Derek Knott, who speeds around the outside for the 19-yard touchdown and a 14-0 lead. After Monmouth scored to cut it to 14-7, Colvin drops in a perfect pass to Lee Kerfus, making it 21-7 at halftime. Monmouth trimmed the lead to 21-17 late in the third quarter with a 15-yard catch and run by Neil Sterling, but that was as close as they'd get as Lehigh forced four turnovers including one final fumble recovery on this desperation play with no time left on the clock. Monmouth tried four laterals before Lehigh's Gerard Gordon picked up the loose ball and ran it for the six-yard touchdown. Lehigh opens the season 1-0 with a 27-17 win on Saturday. Colvin finished with 221 yards passing, including 111 yards to Ryan Spadola, who had nine catches. Receivers left, one receiver out right. Niebrick, he's going to take it in himself. He's lunging towards the goal line, and he is in. Niebrick will move out right. It's an option play, and Niebrick will take it into the end zone himself, untouched. Receiver to the left. They fake the handoff. Higgins pumps. Looking end zone. Wide open is Greg Wilson, and he is in. To the left. Niebrick, screen pass to Wilson, and he's tackled at the 20, but he stays up. He's out to 10, the 5. He's towards the goal line. He is in. Off right tackle. He flips his way into the end zone, and he is in. Fordham ran over Lock Haven 55 0, led by Carlton Kuntz's 146 rushing yards and quarterback Michael Niebrick's four touchdowns, including three on the ground. For Joe Moorhead, his coaching debut at his alma mater was one to remember. It's an unbelievable feeling. You know, um, you know being able to come back here you know, to a place where you play ball and got your education and you know, have the opportunity to be the uh, coach of the football team. Um, you know, it was just a surreal feeling throughout the day, and then it was just capped off with a Unbelievable win. Goal from the four. It goes to Serrata. Serrata goes into the house for the score. Here is Watson faked it to his running back. Touchdown! 38 yard line. Ballas again play action. Throwing. Complete touchdown! Watson gives to Belomo. Belomo takes it. He goes in for the score. Number 12, New Hampshire, went on to win 38-17 Thursday, led by 279 rushing yards. Kevin Watson threw for 271 yards in his first start at Holy Cross. Georgetown opened its season with a 35-14 win over Davidson on Saturday. The Hoyas ran for 280 yards in the game, including 127 from Nick Campanella, who scored three rushing touchdowns and caught another. Colgate jumped out to an early 10-0 lead, but Albany was too much for the Raiders, posting a 40-23 win Saturday. Jordan McCord ran for 136 yards and a touchdown, and quarterback Gavin McCarney completed 16 of 33 passes for 257 yards and a touchdown. Here are the standings after the first week of action. Both Bucknell and Lafayette had the first week off and will open their season this weekend. Thanks for watching Patriot League Roundup and be sure to log on to Patriot League All Access throughout the fall to see all the highlights from around the league. And don't forget to follow us on Facebook and Twitter for all the latest news. I'm Gina Johnson. We'll see you next week.